Hello everyone and welcome to a little tutorial that I'm putting together. Um, if any of you have ever tried to use computer craft while also sort of working with this redneck cable, you may have found that it's no longer supported in the 1.6 build. Um, it says that it's, it's you know it, it's not supported at all um, and what you can't do is you can't call a color output. If you look on the wiki, it says to do the call, you call a number. And you may have found that if you're calling numbers, then you're not getting things that you want. So I'm going to do an example here. Um, and this, this is for later on. So say, for example, if we take this, the white one as one, so these all increment up, two, three, four, five. Now, what the way it looks on the wiki is if you wanted to call this fifth one here, which would be the yellow one, is if we boot up this computer and we go into here, the way you call is you do a redstone dot set bundled output back, so that's where the red, red net cable is connected, and then say you'd say five. That's, that's how it comes across on the wiki. And now what you'll notice is that that fifth one isn't on, but this first and third one are on. Um, and you might find that if you're trying to use numbers, it's just not coming across properly. And the reason for this is that the output of this is actually binary. So if you think of this as, say, a 16-digit binary number, then the last digit of that is going to be 1, which is a 0 or 1, 1. The second digit would be the second 1, which is 2. But if you then said 3, which in binary is 1, 1, you wouldn't get your third output, instead you'd get these two. So I'll demonstrate that with this. So if we set that output to 3, if it's working in binary, what we should expect is to get 1, 1. So if we want to actually get the third the third colour, we want the number in binary, which would be 1, 0, 0, which would be 4. So if we do set bundle output to 4, and just as if we want the fourth one, well, we would want the binary number which is 1, 0, 0, 0, which is 8. So if we now set this bundle output to 8, we should now expect to get the fourth colour. So the way you would figure out just a single colour you want to be output is if you take this as 0, so 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 15, for example, what you do is you take 2 to the power of that number. So, for example, 2 to the power of 0 is 1. So if we set our output to 1, it's this, where 2 to the power of 2, 2 to the power of 3, which is 4. Sorry, no, sorry. 2 to the power of 0, 2 to the power of 1, 2 to the power of 2, which is 2 squared, 4. 2 cubed is 8. 2 to the power of 4. 16, etc, etc. So it basically goes 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128. So if we test that one now, if we do 128, this one here with the black cable should come on. So I'll just quickly put that on. <coughs> so wait, 128. And as you can see, the one with the black cable came on. Now, if you don't understand binary, I've done a little thing here, is that you can see that I've taken a five-digit binary number here. So as you can see, the one on the far right is always your lowest number in binary, just as with decimal. Um, so as you can see, 0, 0, 0, 1, well, that's the one that we see coming on. 0, 0, 0, 1, 0 in a five-digit binary, it would be 2, which is the second one. Whereas 0, 0, 0, 1, 1 is 3, which is why these two are coming on. <coughs> 0, 0, 1, 0, 0 is 4. Also, we'd expect the third one to come on its own. 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, which was, remember, when we put in 5, we got these two coming on. So that's how it works. And uh, if you're not good at minor than that, we just want to see this in action and um, you could do a program that I've kind of set up here. It's a really basic program. Um, so if we go to edit test, and you can see I've set my monitor at the top, cleared my monitor, 
I've done a for loop from I to 1 to 100. That's not the maximum this goes up to. Clear the monitor, set the cursor position to roughly the middle, write the number that we're currently doing, and then set the output to that number and sleep for 1.5 seconds just so we can see it. And then now if we exit out of this and we run the test, we can see how this all goes together. So as you can see here, once we get to 7 or 8, the next one up. So basically once you get to multiples of 2, well, powers of 2 is the single output. Okay, so I hope that was some use to you guys. Um, if you've been having any trouble with computer craft and this retina, redneck cabling and getting the outputs that you want hopefully this will enable you to do it um, what I will do on the description of this is I will add in just a list of those 16 numbers so you can use it in computer craft um, I hope it's useful I hope this was good fun to you guys and I do actually plan to do another one because I saw something about sort of ships moving you see I'm working on it up there and once I get that work in, uh, that will be one with computer craft as well. Have a good day.